name is Harold York. I'm a research scientist in Pasadena, California, and I'll be talking about how carbon dioxide enters into seawater. People are familiar with the concept of carbonated water or carbonated soda. This is carbon dioxide dissolved in water as the basis. They may be surprised to hear, though, that our oceans are also slightly carbonated. In other words, carbon dioxide has dissolved in the ocean water. And the way this happens is through a chemical process. Uh, H2O, that's a water molecule, interacts with CO2, that's the carbon dioxide molecule, to produce carbonic acid, that's H2CO3. H2CO3 itself interacts with water to produce HCO3 minus, that's the bicarbonate uh, ion, and H3O plus, which is uh, hydronium. HCO3 minus, which is here, can interact with water itself to reduce the carbonate ion and hydronium. And finally, when you already have CO3 double minus, other carbon dioxide molecules, again, with water, in water, to produce two bicarbonate uh, ions. So these are the chemical processes. How this actually happens is at the surface interface between water and air, the carbon dioxide uh, molecules can enter into the water. But this, this can also happen in clouds where you have water droplets. And the result is, because this is acidic, uh, is acid rain. And acid rain can then precipitate onto the ocean. That's another way to get uh, carbon dioxide into the ocean. Most of the carbon dioxide enters, though, directly as a solution. The amount of of carbon dioxide that the ocean water can dissolve depends on the temperature. At 32 degrees, this is about three and a half grams per kilogram of water. Uh, but at 68 degrees, that has been reduced by about half. Uh, most of the carbon dioxide being produced by humans through the burning of, false, through the burning of fossil fuels uh, enters into the atmosphere but about one-third of that uh, carbon dioxide uh, is able to be absorbed by the uh, ocean water. Uh, and that turns out to be about two uh, gigatons of carbon per year being absorbed by the ocean. So these are the processes that uh, lead to carbonated water in our ocean. I hope you've enjoyed watching. Thank you.